we're up the river running some trout lines river's still up a little bit it's manageable right now we've been having a hard time uh, with all the lakes nolan barren green river lake they're all letting their letting out after a good hard rain but we did bait the trout line yesterday so and the river's supposed to be trending down but we're actually going to have to run it from the other side of the river So we baited it pretty decent yesterday. There's a lot of weight on the line because of the leaves and stuff. But we just gotta watch for trees and stuff and take it slow. Be careful. Gonna run things opposite today. Yeah, I had to run it backwards because this side is actually up out of the water. The other side's kind of below the water. It is really tight. You said piano string, you weren't lying. Yeah, but it's not. I've ran it the last couple days and got the leaves off of it, so it's uh, it's manageable. Oh, it's really tight. It's not heavy. It's just tight. And yeah, once you, as you come up on stuff, you, you flick it like a guitar string and knock the stuff off of it. No crowd as they've been sitting on there. I've been I've been putting them on there, and we had a. A couple small ones yesterday, I didn't record it or anything, but just haven't had a whole lot of uh, luck with the river level being the way it is. I'm hoping in the next day or two they'll stop letting the lakes out. Actually, I know they will because I've been calling them every day. <laughs> I asked them to do it for my YouTube channel and they said no. Maybe when we're bigger. Yeah. But... It's just this time of year, and uh, we'll fish until we uh, can't fish anymore. Actually, we're going to fish until we catch a 30-plus pounder. If we don't catch a 30-plus pounder, then uh, I'll have to wear a clown suit or something. <laughs> hey, let us know in the comments. We need a good wager. Wager. Yeah, well, me and Nina and AP, we were, were talking separately about, you know, some things that we could do to to kind of make it more fun to be fishing and uh, what would happen if we caught a 10 pound fish Nina has to do this and if we catch a 20 pound fish Nina has to do that or I have to do that and comment below and uh, we'll, we'll use your your comments if, it, if there's anything decent or reasonable if your idea is me in a bikini I'm gonna ignore it yeah so just thump it like a just yeah Yeah, the, the leaves on the line, it causes a lot of weight, which is what kind of, it could break your line if the river level got up too high. Luckily, it hasn't this, this year. It got close, got up to about 12, 13 feet, but the line was able to survive, and we, uh, we've been kind of watching it and almost took it up, but that's the good thing about modern uh, internet and prediction models and data. You, you kind of, you can kind of get a good idea of where, where things are headed. It's really getting heavy now. Yeah, this, uh, this little corner right here is uh, where all the debris comes through. You can kind of tell, like, the current twist over this way. But once you get past it, 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 it loosens up. But I am good, glad to see uh, a little bit of bait left. I, yeah. Oh, we do actually have a fish. Uh -huh. Alright, well, I don't know if that was a catfish or not. Yeah, he's a little feller, though. Let's see if we can just throw him up in the boat, or you can net him. Actually, we hadn't put anything in the boat on camera in a while, so we might want to net him, but... Here goes Nina taking her chances. Oh. Right there, that's supper tonight. Oh, yeah. He's hooked in there, too. Yeah, we can, uh... Fry him up. It's coming, it really is. You got it. I think that was skipjack. Hadn't catching anything, caught anything big yet. But I have faith that once the water goes down a little bit more, hell, we could catch something today for all I know. The weather's just not trending down. It's not getting cooler. 
Yeah, Mother Nature hasn't been working with this. It's supposed to be like a cold front in the middle of October, like even 60 degree days and 40 degree nights. But I still think uh, with the, temp the temperature is lower than what it has been, and if we get the water level right, those fish are going to start moving around, and uh, I'm hoping for a few big flatheads. Take one big flathead. One big flathead, yeah, like 30 plus, 40 plus. There's, there's something there's else. Something on there. All right. Which this, I've been catching them on the bank, obviously, because the current's probably lower. But pull that down. All right, must be careful. I swirl on a little bit. He's about medium. Same. I see some bubbles popping up over there. Might be. Careful. That, that line's under the water there. All right, so we got two fish. That is definitely enough for a fish fry it tonight. Threaded through his lip. Oh, we're frying some fish tonight. We're gonna go through that limb there. Again, the water's kind of swirling around the top of this uh, bend in the river, so just be careful. And we just got to knock all the limbs off and all the leaves. Once you get past the current here, though, it's actually pretty decent. Through the trees. Beyond the pine. As long as there's one piece of bait left. Oh, we got two pieces of bait. Yeah. Oh! Yeah. <laughs> got a little flathead. Little bitty. He wasn't even fighting. It scared me, actually. I was looking it at... It kind of startled me, too. I seen his head. I was like, that's a eel or a snake. I just looked down and saw an open mouth. Yeah, let's net him that way. Just, sometimes you can pull it up and not let it get tangled in the net. Like, don't let it get tangled in the net. There you go. That'll be a a good little flathead fillet. One hush puppy with this guy. <laughs> yeah, it's got more than you think. Oh, this goldfish is still alive. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> what? Pull her up. Oh man. He, see that that current is keeping him from from yeah, from they, running. They keep startling me. Yeah, the current. They're just sitting there in the current. That's. Yeah, you're gonna have to net that one. But if you oh, watch out! Watch for the tree. All right, Nina's a professional nowadays. Heavy, heavy, heavy line. Careful, I'm watching. Yes, get him up in there. Not bad, guys. Not bad. Not bad. It's four fish, not bad. It's a fish, that's not bad. <laughs> that fish right there, I'd be happy with. <laughs> Every time. He's Every like, you time. talking about me? <laughs> you talking about me? Jesus. Nope. It's like he knows we're going to eat him. You know, honestly, he probably does. Because you think, what is the only... A fish is only fear, you know, to be eaten. I mean, if I was a fish, I'd be scared of sharks. <laughs> yeah, for, of eating me. I just got the weirdest urge to put my big toe in his mouth. How dare you. <laughs> I would have laughed if he jumped down.